Hey, Gorillas, question for you. I want to get more serious about making my sales training slash coaching, but I don't know how to price my services. Do I offer a one-time training, ongoing, or both? Do I charge hourly or flat rate? Just charge for one session at a time or have minimum packages? I have two calls tomorrow. Both trainings would be for inbound closing. One is for an individual. The other is a six-person team. How much should I charge discount for a team training? Right now, I'm pricing myself at 100 to 130 an hour. If I'm just doing hourly, so using that as a base to go on, how should I set up my pricing model? There's a bunch of different ways that you can do this. First, you need to do enough market research with the people that you're serving with this to understand what it is that they want, what it is that they expect to pay, what they're looking for value-wise for dollars. Um, I don't know where these people are. Are they over the phone? Are these people local in New York? $100 to $130 an hour, unless you're coaching somebody who's like, um, you know, kind of small potatoes is not a whole lot. Unless your coaching needs to be like 700 hours, right? There's a couple of different ways that you can do this. And you covered most of them. But really, to be able to price yourself you got to understand what they need, how you, whatever process it is that you take them from A to B to get them the result that they're looking for, right? If you're just going to be a mentor and you're going to walk them through a sales training process and there's no like step one, step two, step three result, um, then yeah, I would do an hourly. For the most part, it doesn't come from yourself. It comes from them, right? So there's a couple of things to take into account your competitors in your marketplace, what are they charging? What are they providing? What kind of results are they getting for the people that they're training and coaching? And you can kind of base it off of that. Now, as far as your ability to get them results, obviously you need to be able to take them through a process to help them get a result. And that's going to be based on your experience level. Knowing what I know, if I were in your shoes, I would be probably somewhere in the neighborhood of six one-hour sessions at two and a quarter to 275 an hour. And you need to be able to, in six one-hour sessions, take a person or a small team who's all following a process and get them from point A to point B where they get results. If I was in your shoes, that's what I would be doing. $225 $225 to $275 an hour for six one-hour sessions. Um, and you need to be able to have a process that you take them from A to B to C result. I know this sounds dumb, but other than just Google searching, how do I scout my competitors? There's a bunch of different ways, but it, really it's one of the first steps in the process that you need to go through is identifying the landscapes that you're competing in, right? If I go out and build a Porsche 911, C4, red, twin turbo, top of the line, and I go out into the marketplace and it's $9 million, but the competition selling that car for 185 grand, right? On the flip side, if I go out and build that same car and take it to market for $45,000 and the competitor is selling it for 185, way out of line. It's all based on where they're at and where they want to go and if you can get them the results and in what period of time. And then you break it down by price. It's gotta be something that's realistic for their world. If you've got somebody now who's char- who you're charging 100 to 130 an hour, cool. Do that for the, that client or those two clients and then the next client, double that price. It's 200 an hour. We should be able to get X done in six hours. Sometimes it goes eight one hour sessions. Um, but it would be something along those lines. You also have to have a process, right? Like a, an actual process that you take people through, um, to give you an idea, the course that we're doing, the course that we've put together for this is quite a bit more than six, one hour sessions. And we're selling it for a thousand bucks doing the one-on-one coaching thing. It goes up because that limits your ability to help people. Right? So it's kind of somewhere in that ballpark. I kind of think that I've so pretty much offer several options. Yeah, man, we are getting into like super open question territory. 
If you offer people more than two options, it confuses the brain. They don't have the ability to make a choice. You need to have two options. The way that I would do that is I would say, generally, I charge 200 an hour. This is just an example. And we do six sessions. You're looking at 1200 bucks and I should be able to get you from A to B, provided you're intelligent and can follow instructions. Or we can do this one off at $325 an hour and you go two sessions with me or if we get, you know, past four or five sessions, then we readjust that. Um, if you want to go that route, if you're going to offer more than one option, only make it two options. Peace out, Cub Scouts.